a pentagonal pyramid of base edge 30 mm and height 60 mm rest on the hp such that one of the edges of its base is parallel to the vp the pyramid is cut by a plane inclined at 40 degrees to the hp draw the lateral development of the truncated pyramid so in this problem we have to draw the development of the pentagonal pyramid so for this one we have to draw the first the front view and top views of the pentagonal pyramid and then section the front view in the given position so in the previous problem up to previous problems we have to draw only the development of the particular given solid but in this problem we have to draw both the section of solids as well as the development of surfaces so for this purpose we have to draw the first development of surface sorry section of surface solids and go for the development of surfaces so for this one the base is resting on the hp so the base uh, true shape of the pentagonal pyramid is pentagon shape so base is resting on hp means we have to draw the top view with a pentagonal shape and with the front view as a triangular shape why because it is a pyramid okay so for this one we have to draw the first pentagon with a side of 30 mm and construct a pentagon with a b c d e and apex point is a o and project each and every point to the reference line x y from a with a b c d e and project the apex point o as o dash with a height of a total given the axis and after that 60 mm so mark the point mid 32 mm from the bottom base as a reference point and make an angle of 40 degrees draw the section plane like this so base point nunchi axis height oka 32 mm daggara oka point mark cheskovali ikkada point mark cheskunna dani reference point ga teeskoni 40 degrees incline line draw cheyali and this ee line em antam ante section plane antam anta. so after cutting the section plane through the front view and mark the points wherever the intersection the pentagon sorry pyramid pentagonal pyramid 1 dash 2 dash 3 dash 4 dash and again 5 dash so for this one if this is a slant height we have to develop this diagram with the help of the horizontal lines from slant distances so for this one 1 dash is already in the slant line and 2 dash is on the center axis project this point to the slant edge and again 3 dash is projected in the horizontal one 3 3 1 double dash 4 1 dash and 5 1 dash ओके सो सैक्न प्लेन पैन उइंट्स वन डाश टू डाश थ्री डाश फोर डाश फाइव डाश अटा का मन की ड्रा चे डेवलपमेंट स्लांट हईट उबी स्लांट हईट क्या मल्ल इकडनी हारजेंट लाइन ईच अंड एवरी पाइं प्रोजेक्ट ओके आफ्टर दटेक ए पॉइंट सो टेक ए पॉइंट फ्रम ओ वित् हारजेंटल लाइन and make an angle so making a center point o as a center point and oa as a radius draw an arc up to the locus of line o so in the mundu problem lo la gane manaki ikkada kuda o nunchi oka horizontal line draw chesi oa ni radius ga iskoni oka arc draw chestam and ee point nunchi manaki section sorry reference line pai ikka draw cheskunnam ante ee point em avutundi 3 double dash so we have to draw a 3 double dash join with the o dash line a double dash line nunchi ओ डाश की एड्ज लाइस दट इज नथिंग बट दू स्ट लेंथ आफ दि एड्ज ओ डाश ए डाश नव मेजर द डिस्टेंस बिटवी ओ डाश टू ए डबल डाश अंड मार्क एवनी कन्वीन पॉइंट ओ ऐस ए सेंटर ड्रा एंड आर्क लैक् दिस् ओके ओ अने पाइंट कन्वीन पाइंट दर्को सो इक ओ डबल डाश नीचे ए डबल डाश लेंथते लेंथ तो मैं आर्क ड्रा चाहे ओके अंड आफ्टर दट वन we have to mark the points a b c d e again again a with a side distance equal to 30 mm on the arc so first mark the point any convenient point a on the curve and make a radius of a 30 mm cut the next arc and this point is a b and taking b as a center and with convenient radius so 30 mm radius draw an arc which gives the point c and taking c as a center point and radius equal to same 30 cut the arc from point d and taking d as a cap center point and the same radius 30 cut the point e 
and with e as a center point and radius equal to a so 30 and cut the again another line that is nothing but the a okay so which will gives the five equal divisions and now join all these five points to the apex point o with a thick line and then mark the points 1 2 3 4 5 and again 1 on the slant line o dash a double dash and join all these points with a thick lines which will gives the lateral development of the truncated pentagonal pyramid okay so in this video in this one this slant lines b2 c3 4d 5e and 1a also thick lines why because it is a pyramid these edges must be visible okay so this is the solution for the given problem if you have any doubt in this problem please comment in the below section we will solve more number of problems like this so thank you for watching this video